I think sometimes we can forget that Roblox is a learning game too. I mean, they even have their own tab, Learn and Explore. There are so many things that you can learn on Roblox. Vlogsburg teaches you how to lead a balanced life and hold down a job. Hey, yo, the pizza here. Oh! Football Fusion teaches you how to play football. Realistic Hood Testing teaches you street smarts. Get off my lawn! Get off my lawn! How to drink and drive? Roblox is full of knowledge! So in today's video, I'm gonna figure out what I can learn from playing Roblox games from the Learn and Explore tab. That guy learned how to fight gravity. Look at him. The first game we're gonna be starting with today is the Children's Art Museum. Let's see what we can learn here in the Children's Museum of Art. Ah, oh, yes, the saint. Oh, I can click it. Ah! Jump scare? Jeez. Guys, I can't really say that I'm learning all that much. Like the only thing that I'm learning is that kids should not pick up pencils. I'm kidding, I'm kidding. <laughs> guys, guys, forget the art. I found a crossbow. <laughs> it's supposed to be for the balloon shooter, but I snuck it out. I'm gonna go see if it works on people. There's two other people here. Just imagine somebody joining this game. Oh my gosh, it's the Children's Art Museum. Why does that guy have a crossbow? <laughs> I used to be an artist and then I took an arrow to the moon. Those are fake people, guys. Those those green guys that don't have walk animations, they're not real. You are not real. Guys, there's two other people here. I want them to learn. Two hours later. I found a guy. Moment of truth. Why does it kill? I just killed that guy. Well, I'm not learning anything today. A whole bunch of people just joined and a whole bunch of people are about to leave. Welcome to the children's art museum, everybody. Wait a minute, I can kill these namaste guys. Look, they're saying namaste. I don't know what that means though. Hey. Yeah. Hi. What are you learning today? We're learning about life and death. Very unfortunate lessons we're learning today. Do I get points for this? Oh my gosh, I get points for this. I'm a fan, Jake. I had the highest kill streak in uh, the Children's Art Museum game. So what did we learn from this game, guys? If we can exploit a weakness in a game, we can make it fun. Up next, we have the math obby. 125 divided by five. Oh, that's 17, easy. And so from this game, we've learned that division is hard and I don't like it and it makes me mad. Up next, we have the trolley game. Welcome to the trolley game. You'll be given different ethical scenarios, but with a twist. What decision will you make? We're gonna learn about life ethical decisions here. Look out, a trolley is approaching one person. You can pull the lever to divert it to the other track, running over a million free Robux. I don't even know that guy. I don't even know that guy like that. 60% of people agree with me. The brakes on a self-driving car fail as it is approaching a barrier. Should the car change lanes and run over four people illegally crossing the road instead? They are illegally crossing the road, you know. 65% of people agree with, thank you, thank you. The brakes on a self-driving car fail as it is approaching one person illegally walking across the street. Should the car change lanes? No! Don't break the law in front of me, I'm gonna break you. Oh, wait, what's this? Hold on. The brakes on a self-driving car fail is approaching a very handsome cat. Should the car change lanes and run into a barrier instead? Yes, yes we should, that's a very handsome cat. Oh, it's the same thing here! Should the car change lanes and run to a barrier instead? I think it should! The brakes on a self-driving clown car. Carrie, <laughs> doing that thing, it's a clown car. It's a clown car. Oh my God, no, you can't do this to me. You know what, guys? That dog has no body. What kind of life is that? Not a good one. That makes sense. You have to admit, that makes sense. Look out, a trolley is approaching five people. You can pull the lever to divert it to the other track, sacrificing one person instead. However, it won't do a totally grand loop de loop. Oh, we gotta do the loop de loop. Whoa, that was sick. Do that again. Look out, a trolley is heading towards five people. You can pull the lever to save them, but that would require you to get up from watching TV. What will you do? Uh, it's a really good show that's on right now. I'm not gonna do anything. Oh wait, I've seen this episode. Look out, a trolley is heading towards an empty track. But you, you, you were a born lever puller. Are you gonna pull that? You're born to do it. You have to. You were born to pull those levers. Wow, 
I've learned a lot from this game, guys. I've learned that I'm just a natural born lever puller. Amazing stuff. Just simply amazing. This is a learning YouTube channel. Make sure you subscribe. If you've learned something so far, like the video and leave a comment. Parents, you're welcome. They don't have to go to school today. They're good. What else can we play? Endangered world. What the hell is happening? Why are all the animals on fire? Did you do this? What do I do with the camera? There, I got a picture of you. I'll remember you. This African elephant is injured. Do you want to heal it? I mean, it's on fire. Yes. I think I saved it. But it how do I stop this forest fire? There's water right here. How do I get it over there? I'll splash it in. This isn't working. Oh, there's water here. Oh, I'm doing it. This isn't helping. The only thing this game is teaching me is that we're all screwed. I'm trying. I really am. Oh, good. She's going to help me. I'm so sad. The animals are dying. Is this global warming? Whoa, that's wino. That's so cool. <gasps> we did it. Oh, my God. We did it. Oh, no. Oh, no. I found the remains of somebody. This game is awesome. So there's a lion. There's a leopard. We got elephants here. We got impalas. It's a zebra over there. This is awesome. Awesome. I am a little confused though on what that thing is over there. Hey there, dude. Is that an animal or like what now? It just waved. Oh, it's mouth just open. I'm out of here. I'm out of here. Leaving the game. Leaving the game. Guys, I did some digging and I found out that this thing is called a micro. It must be a, a relatively new species. Um, hopefully it's in danger. So in this video, we learned that giraffes are like totally wicked and they're like the coolest animal ever. <laughs> Look at this long neck. No, but actually guys, this game has like a lot of interesting facts about animals like zebras. It has its own unique stripe pattern, you know? Elephants, heaviest land animal in the world. Lions, the only type of big cat to live together in groups. <laughs> Michael is weird as hell. <laughs> Find the animals, Backpack Explorer. We're gonna learn about nature here. It's a beautiful day for a hike. Oh, hello, Mr. Raccoon. Oh, you're so cute. Caterpillar, they never stop eating. Oh, they so cute, little wormy. Oh, look, there's an owl. Owls can be creepy, though. They could be creepy. Oh, guys, look. It's a deer. All right, I've got it in my sights. Boom, headshot. Guys, I've been looking around for Wormy, but he wasn't in his normal spot. I don't know where he went. Wormy, there you are. I've been looking all around for... Huh? Well, Wormy, what's wrong? <laughs> and what we learned from this game is, damn, nature, you scary. And the last game that we will be learning stuff from today's video. Drum roll, please. It's going to be Frappe. Frappe? More like crappe. Hey, hey, thank you guys so much for watching. We've learned so much this video. Please like and subscribe. Leave a comment of your funniest part. You star code Jake. I love you. Mwah.